While the TSA compromised its locking system with this master key pick, you probably missed that zombie chat roulette is a thing, the drink stick for good times, and 3D printed glass. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, where power cords will probably rise up to kill us well before the robots. Help! Fiber optic cables are useful, but they're also expensive and still end up making you hate life. Right, Shaq? <laughs> but now, MIT's Mediated Matter Group thinks they can make it better with their 3D glass printer. Take a peek inside the 1900 degree Fahrenheit kiln as the printer carefully layers molten glass in 3D printing style. Besides becoming glass artists, the team hopes their printer will lead to cheaper fiber optics to overly connect all of our electronic devices. Did you ever wish that your Call of Duty zombie battles were a little more like gamer? Control of a human being in full-scale combat. Thanks to the production team from Realm Pictures, Chat Roulette users were surprised with a live first-person shooter adventure against a horde of zombies. Users controlled their character with voice commands. Uh, uh, jump over that or smash it. Go for the headshots, man. Go for the head headshots. Go for the right. Get some. Oh, there's gonna be something in that pot. Check what's in that pot. The game includes sound effects, a rhino turret, and rocket launchers. The production quality is really fantastic, especially since the producers only spent about $1,400 creating this. Everyone who wants to get bombed in the privacy of their own home has another handy solution for when they're also feeling classy. The Mix Sticks will hit Kickstarter by next month for an easy 39 bucks. Just drop it into a glass, sync with the smartphone app over Bluetooth, and add ingredients to the appropriately lighted line. Also, you can tell the app what ingredients you have and see what it suggests. How about gin, lemons, and sadness? You can really taste the tears. And now TLDR, where we run through the week's headlines because there was a lot. Elon Musk's Hyperloop inked a deal with a vacuum pump company. Spotify pissed off some users with a revamped user agreement. Hackers released data on more than 37 million Ashley Madison users. Google dropped its demand that new Android phones ship with Google Plus. And George Washington University researchers figured out how to turn atmospheric carbon into diamonds. That's all the weird for the week. I'll be on vacation, so enjoy the fill-ins.